Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be creating this Instagram inspired look. I came across this picture on Instagram and I figured, you know what, let me try to recreate this look. So if you want to see how I achieved it, just keep on watching. So I was inspired by this look on Instagram. I saw somebody with the look. I can't even remember who it was. Those pictures that come up on your feed on the Explorer page. I was like, whoa, I want to recreate that look. Now I'm just doing eyebrows. Alright, we're not going to spend the whole day doing eyebrows, so I'm going to leave it at this. So I'm going to go in and prep the lid with concealer. I'm not going to use the liquid concealer that I always use when I am doing eyeshadow because I'm going to do a very light eye. The focus is not going to be an eyeshadow today, but the liner. So, so I'm going to go in with a dark color. I'm using the Morphe Nightmaster palette. I'm going to use this dark color for the crease. This might be a little bit even darker than I wanted, but you know, we'll just work with it. And I'm not going to go in and put more products. I'm just going to use what I have on the brush and just blend it in in hopes to have it look more balanced. I don't want it to look too harsh. Are you guys excited for spring? The weather's been promising lately. You know, it was really warm on Friday. We had a high of 75 degrees. So I am seriously hoping that winter is done. I'm gonna put this color You know what? I'm gonna use this color this is lighter before I had used this but now I'm gonna use this and then I'm gonna use my finger to apply this on the lid just a little bit in the center so like that I'm gonna do like this just to give it a little pop okay. so now I'm gonna go in with the elf eyeliner that I pretty much always use and work on this wing So I think I'm done with the eyes. I'm going to go ahead and put mascara. I'll be using this blue shadow by MAC called Freshwater for the tear duct. Okay, I like it. I'm gonna go 
go ahead and put glue on the lashes and go ahead and do foundation and everything else while the glue dries up and I will put it on foundation I use the Clinique stay oil free foundation I'm using the LA Girl Concealer in shade Fawn. So I'm going to set that highlight with the NYX HD Finishing Powder. To contour, I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty Matte Stick and Espresso. I'm just going to use the other side of the Beauty Blender. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and set this look with powder. I use the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Powder in the shade Dark. Okay, so now I'm gonna set the contour using the ABH Bronze Powder in Mahogany. Now I'm going to apply blush. I use Raisin by MAC. Highlighter, I use Iridescent Bronze Gold. Golden Bronze. I never get this name right. And this is by MAC as well. I'm gonna go in with this concealer that I used to highlight, the LA Girl Concealer, and just sharpen my bra bone. And I'm just gonna use my finger to blend. And for the lower lashes, I'm going to go in with a dark color that I used for the outer corner.
I want the tear duct to have a little bit of glitter so I'm gonna use the highlighter that I used and go in and add this to the blue apply mascara on the lower lashes For my lips, I'm going to apply Angel by MAC, but I'm going to line them with a brown pencil first. And then I'm going to apply this lightly because I don't want it to be too dark. So that's good. And I'm going to apply... That's the finished look. I'm going to set the look with setting spray. This is the Charged Water by MAC. And this is the finished look. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and comment on this video. Hit the subscribe button and I will see you in my next one. Bye.